So <clears throat> above the water line, there's no real major issues. Um, we have a really, we have a corner back here that when you flex the boat at the bow, this corner opens all the, closes all the way and opens back up as well as this corner opens and closes back up. So, uh, but uh, that shows you how flexible the boat is. Uh, that's kind of an easy fix back here. We can take care of that, but we have serious problems with the bottom of the boat. So starting with a stringer that is broken off, uh, looks like it may have been rotted off. And this stringer should extend back to what's called the transom bow, which is the structural member right back here. And um, I can tell the transom bow has not been replaced, which, uh, and these transom bows were the Achilles heel of these boats. Um, this was usually the first thing to go. You'll also notice um, that the transom post back here has been worked on in the past. So there's some kind of issue back there that wasn't, I can tell was not properly addressed, at least not with proper workmanship. Um, we have um, cracked battens. These are the uh, the planks butt together on the back side of these battens. As a matter of fact, we have a cracked batten here that you can see daylight through. So <clears throat> we've got some battens that need to be replaced. We have a frame here that's broken, as you can see, and, and it's rotted. We have uh, rot on this frame right here. And we have rot in the chine back here. That's rot in the chine. Um, so, like, if we just had to take care of this one corner, it wouldn't be too bad. But, unfortunately, uh, the bad news continues. So, uh, we're, you know, we're farther up here. We've got still got broken, broken chine. we got a cracked plank here. And uh, it extends a couple of frames. We have, um, we have, of course, you were aware of how the trailer was damaging the boat. Um, and that, that plank, that's the end of your bunk. And that plank is actually cracked uh, and broken through. Um, on the other side, we have the, and, and this frame is rotted. You can you know, I've just got a little, I just pointed the end of my dowel rod in a pencil sharpener. And, you know, I'm, and we broke off this with just a dowel rod. Um, we have a cracked frame back here as well. Um, we have, uh, we detected rot right in here between these two frames. Uh, we have rot right there. We have rot on that frame right there. Uh, we have detected rot between these two frames and that seam. Um, and uh, and uh, it actually gets worse. And of course, uh, um, this you were aware of this already, and that's where the trailer is damaging it on this side of the boat. And on the other side of the boat, we have the same thing going on. Uh, we also have a cracked plank right there uh, and more rot in this frame. Uh, so basically we had 15 frames that we had rot in. Oh, and here's, I was gonna bring you over and show you the damage the trailer's doing to this side of the boat. So we got a batten that's cracked. We have a frame, a frame that is cracked right here and pushed up probably at least an inch. That frame's rotted. We have a separation of the side stake in the frame here and rod right in there. Uh, this particular frame is also rotted off here. We've got rot, uh, rot right here as well. And another cracked plank and a cracked frame here. So, uh, and then more cracked battens here here and here and of course the the cracks are off off the center so that's got to be your fastener line that's holding your plank on so 
uh, bottom line is uh, by the time that we repaired all of the